Hi everybody, this is Jazz, aka Trend Trader for you, providing you uh, with a uh, wrap up video for all the trades that I called out for you guys. Uh, and we'll start out um, by looking at CY. CY was uh, called at at the open, and I called out um, short below 1185, right below this. Never triggered. Just wanted to show you this, and this is how a lot of trades get saved. And also at that point, there was a big uh, gap, um, not gap, but a big spread in it too. So I was kind of cautious about this. But anyways, this was never triggered. And then um, called out, uh, I believe, APL. I'm not going to show you exactly my calls on the stock twits. Feel free to uh, look at them under handle T-R-E-N-D, T-R-A-D-E-R, -E uh, the number four, and alphabet U, trend trader for you. And it's all linked up with the Twitter, Facebook, and uh, as well as uh, uh, is stock twits. So APPL was another call that I called. I said high, uh, long above 2813, which was... Uh, Right around here, I said long above 2813 with a stop below 2752. So basically, I was trying to uh, call this trade uh, with a stop uh, below uh, yesterday's low as well as today's uh, low. So anyways, it went up and look at it. Nice, beautiful, uptrending uh, stock. It had a nice run. Uh, 2813 is at 2943. And these kind of trades are the trades that will take care of all the small stop outs you have. Or even if... Uh, you were able to take you know 30 40 60 cents out of it as you know that i, I love my 30 cents as soon as i get my 30 cents, i take them off and let some run depending on the position size that i have i'm not a big trader as most of you guys are and i don't have to claim uh to be a big trader because i see all these posts you know um, going long 1k going long here and you know it's just not my style i what i do i provide simple setups it's uh, your call to uh see how exactly you want to or what position size you want to go into as far as trading so anyways this is still working out guys there is no weakness in it uh, it's still uh, it, it could go it, it was if you look at the daily chart I'm not gonna go into too detail if you look at the daily it had a really nice bottoming uh, pattern here and they bounced up and if you look at this three minute and still going up and another call that I made was JDST uh, excuse me Another call was a JDST it was long above 1656, 1656 right around here with a uh, stop below 1607 right around here and it went up to about a 1674 uh, I guess you know again uh, it did give about 20 cents but it's just not uh, I wasn't able to you know just profit on that one a little bit more out of it didn't give me that's fine but uh, down the road I said a uh, once I see some of the weakness run here, I said I'm killing it around. So I killed it around a 1645 area, right around a, right around this area. And you know I was fine with it to take a small loss, rather to let it trade all the way down. It eventually, would stop me out. But even if you want to call the stop out, that's fine. It was you know still a stop out. So anyway, so that was that. And again, it was uh, another one that I called RCL. RCL was um, long above 7603. Uh, right around this area with 75.50 a uh, stop and gave a quick pop quick 30 uh, 7603 right here give a quick pop to 76.34 and the stop is still valid if you if you took it but what i did on this actually went up to 760 what i did on this i canceled this trade so i will consider this as a canceled trade uh, if you took it that's fine you didn't take it that's totally up to you but i just wanted to go over with all the trades now i'm i'm not gonna uh, not go over the stop outs or only go over the winners because that's all I see. I have people posting uh, trades that are uh, uh, that are that, that they're claiming. Did somebody take it? I tweeted yesterday. I did that. I did that. You know, it really doesn't matter to me. I want uh, you know they're trying to look good, but to who they're trying to look good? You know, uh, call your trades out and be um, comfortable in taking that stop and be have have that pride that you know what you're stopped out and. That's it, and that's how that's how the trading is. And it, the biggest uh, emotion you can deal with is saying, you know what, I call the trade out, and I'm stopped out. Simple as that. You know, you go on, take another trade, take another trade. So that was RCL, and uh, then another one that I called C C E L G was 116.30, uh, 116 long, but 116.30. And 115.67 was the stop and gave a quick 30 cents. That's exactly what I like. 
and came down and eventually stopped me out uh, on the rest of it. If if anybody took it, you know, I actually went in there and said, you know, move your stop as it was going up. So you had the time to lower your risk on it. Okay, and then the another one. Uh, EYES was my one of the biggest call today, and I called EYES uh, long above 14 area, which is right there, long above 14 area, and it just spiked up, spiked up. It was stop was the low of the day. And it has a huge spread on it. I was uh, saying that um, into my tweets that it has a huge spread. So be careful about this. Uh, the reason why I picked this because in daily, if you look, it was just, you know, putting a bottom every single day. And it was just uh, more like uh, uh, it was not, it was definitely a counter trending stock. But I was looking at a trade uh, a, a, for an intraday, not for a swing, not for anything. Because it could still come down. I have my alert here. If it comes down, I might take a shot at it. But I might not. So anyways, it gave a quick pop to 14 something. Then it ran up to 15.25. So trades like this will take care of the small losers like uh, the one I showed you, right? And uh, there was, I'm just going over with the list I have. Uh, and then Nugget, NUGT. I had three trades that actually gave a whole dollar, right? So NUGT was called. I actually took a little bit earlier, about 13.05. And I was out around um, 13.97. Uh, but I call this trade around long above 1320, right? Long above 1320 uh, with a stop at 1267, uh, 1267, right around, actually below the low of the day. Beautiful, beautiful run. And I talked about 1403 being a target and it reached there and kind of almost came pretty close to fill the gap. And here it's coming down again. And beautiful call, right? Uh, this worked. Uh, you know, it was a counter trending stock, but I saw this gap and saw that it was trying to reverse and exactly what happened and gave a really nice risk reward ratio on it. Beautiful, beautiful trade I had on this one. And um, I believe uh, that's it. I had a, you know, uh, just couple, a couple stop offs if you want to look at it that way. And the uh, rest of them are really, really nice winners. One stock I'm going to talk about is this. Uh, this stock, uh, you know, I saw this somewhere. Somebody was posting this uh, about long above high of the day or something, right? Uh, with the stop below. Uh, totally fine. Nothing wrong with that. But look at the volume down here, guys. This is, this is, these are the stocks you want to stay away. You know, 4,000, you know, uh, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000. This is, that's not the volume you want to be trading. And more, even if it, didn't have the volume what it was what i was looking at was a spread on it the spread was about 12 to 15 cents and think about it, if you're going long 200 stocks with 15 cents of a spread you're down already 30 bucks right so and you know somebody called this trade out eventually worked you know a little bit and you know again it worked if you did this uh, 1486 and went up to uh gave about uh you could say about about 30 you know roughly about a little bit of uh, below 30 cents, right? So that's totally fine. But having the spread on it, and look at this bar right there. I mean, you would be trading a 40.93, and all of a sudden, a stock comes under 40.57. This is these are the stocks you don't want to look at. I'm looking at the time and sales right now. Hardly anything, hardly anything. So you know, stay away from stocks like this. I don't, I don't mean to point fingers at anybody. All I'm trying to do is educate the right way, right? And the right way is to you know, find stocks that are that have volatility. Find stocks that have that are showing you that they want to go up or they want to go down. But stay away from the stocks that have high spread on it. In fact, the EYES had a high spread on it, I, and I said, you know, this has a really high spread on it. But you know, my whole thesis on that was, you know, having the stop here and going long here, and I wasn't trading enough. If I mean, long of a position size, right? And if you want to trade those kind of stuff, that's okay. You know, trade, but lower your position side and this had a spread about um but probably about five to eight cents when i took the trade so that was fine with me anyway so stay away from those kind of trades uh and you know let let the others roll out uh, i believe that's all i have on here and um i'll be uh posting this on the youtube and feel free to follow me on um on face on facebook uh I have in my private group and you can go to my website www.trendtrader4u.com um, or you can email me info at trendtrader4u.com and I'll send you the private uh, Facebook link so you can join and I post all the educational like this uh, video will probably go on there. Anyways guys, you guys take care and I'll talk to you guys later. Oh, you know what? Actually, um, <laughs> I'm sorry. I had to show you this. 
uh, I took this trade, right? I actually got filled at, I, and I posted about this. I get, uh, I said, I, I am going long above, uh, not posted it, but I took it without posting it. But I wanted to talk about this since is it is top out. So I got filled, right? My entry order was 399 and I got exactly filled at the penny uh, for long, right? And bear back it comes. And, you know, I was so disappointed in this. And of the time of the day I was taking the trade was wrong time of the day. So I was eventually stopped out of it, which is totally fine. You know, that's, that's, I live up to uh, my stops and I learn from them rather than, um, and I'm not showing it to you guys, but this was a trade that I filled in at the penny, but it was stopped out. So anyways, guys, uh, take care, and uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Take care. Bye.